a think tank which uh, is supposed to be a regional project. And uh, I uh, just hope that not only our Romanian uh, colleagues and partners, but all our regional partners will uh, understand, support, and be together in this very new and uh, very necessary project. I will uh, have a very short introduction. And then, of course, we hope to socialize and to know each other a little bit better and to take this uh, unfamiliar environment as a good opportunity to talk about something else than politics, which uh, I, I hope that many of us really want. What is uh, Black Sea Regional Project? It's a national and regional project of economic diplomacy because uh, I think that Romania and the region really needs economic diplomacy. And I think that a lot of efforts, ideas, knowledge, and expertise should be used for this so such an important goal. It's uh, a long time ago, a very wise person told me that everything we need, it's uh, synthesized in three main issues a vision, what do, we want, what do we want to do, for concrete projects, and the right people. And I think that vision, projects, and people is what we are looking for. And thank you very much for uh, attending this first event of the <coughs> BSRP think tank. I'm trying to get familiar with the English pronunciation of the BSRP. The vision is about the Black Sea region, but Black Sea region, I think that now, means all the region toward the south, the Middle East, the Northern Africa, the Arabic Gulf, all, the, all these countries and the region uh, which is looking for a better future, for a better cooperation, and needs projects to develop. All the efforts that Romania and other governments and countries in the region have done in the last years have been to this idea that we need more cooperation, we need better projects, and we need a common and shared vision. I think that uh, new projects are absolutely necessary for uh, Romania and for the countries which are sharing the same goals of development. And uh, only the, the political uh, establishment and the government establishment is not able alone to promote this project. I think that using the experience and the knowledge that we have accumulated in our previous administrative and political position will be very useful in this new effort. Projects. I, we have started the idea of this uh, think tank from a clear reality. Romania has succeeded as a country in its two major projects after 89. First of all, the security project, which is uh, clearly fulfilled by being a member of NATO and having a strategic partnership with the United States, and being a part of a family which has clear values, and this is the European Union family. But now, Romania and the countries in the regions, we need the next step. And the next step will be a sustainable economic development and uh, prosperity, which uh, everybody was expecting to come after security and uh, shared values. And that's why... <coughs> <coughs> I should also add that we need health, for, but uh, this is something more difficult than prosperity, it seems. Um, very concrete projects and big projects should include the region of the Black Sea and the region of the Eastern Mediterranean, like uh, the great project of the New Silk Road, which is, has been launched and supported so clearly by China, like all the energy especially the inner energy infrastructure, but the new trends in energy in the region, like uh, transportation, 
and uh, big investments, like attracting to this region, which now looks as a very troubled region, attracting big investments from the United States and big Asian uh, companies, which are absolutely necessary for the future. The people uh, are also very important because a vision and projects needs people. And that's why I have uh, asked some of my former colleagues, which uh, have been uh, in my administrative team, to join me in this effort. And I am very grateful to all of them, because I think that uh, the expertise, the experience, the success and the failures that we have had in uh, so many projects and implementing this vision is very important. That's why I would uh, like to present to all of you uh, something which is uh, already official, that uh, in the team of the think tank uh, have been already members, founders, founding fathers. Uh, some of my colleagues, former Minister of Agriculture, Health, Education, uh, Finance, Justice, and uh, <clears throat> the Labour Minister and uh, many other colleagues to whom we have tried to share this vision and to work together. And uh, our idea is in the future to try to use all the knowledge of the Romanian society, of the knowledge and experience of the regional uh, countries in order to promote this important vision of cooperation and the new projects. The former Prime Minister of Georgia, Mr. Garibashvili, he has also joined the think tank. And uh, I'm also expecting some other friends and prime ministers to join the, the uh, foundation as soon as they are going to be former. Uh, for the time being, they have to work in their offices. But uh, I strongly believe that uh, friendship, common values, and uh, common vision can uh, really help us in, uh, in doing this. I would just conclude saying once again something that I have stated from the beginning. And of course, I'm saying this in English because it's not going to be a breaking news. The think tank does not want and does not wish to be involved in internal politics internal politics of Romania or some other countries. I think that internal politics is for the political leaders. And I thank our colleagues, friends, political leaders being uh, also here. And I congratulate them for their courage, because doing politics in our region is definitely the most riskiest job, 10 times more risky than being a member of an NGO. Uh, but uh, the idea is to promote projects, to promote cooperation, to promote development, and uh, just using our experience from our previous administrative position in order to be effective for this. I would like to thank you, all of you, for this. Pot acum să trec la limba română și să spun încă o dată că apreciez foarte mult Curajul celor care au venit la această lansare. Am mai primit încă vreo 3-400 de mesaje. Am fi, aș fi vrut să fiu acolo alături de tine, dar e mai bine să nu vin, dar te susțin și mă bucur pentru asta. Um, pot să spun în limba română că foarte mulți oameni de bună credință sunt alături de noi. Unii mi-au și zis că să am grijă cu banii pe care am primit deja în fundație și am zis că am grijă având în vedere că nu avem cont încă. Deci să avem foarte mare grijă. Dar astea sunt lucrurile care țin de societatea noastră și de aceea le-am spus în limba română. Uh, think tank pe care îl lansăm astăzi are și un partener media, singurul care a avut curaj să ne fie partener. Uh, nu știu dacă reprezentantul... Deci, mai are încă curajul și puterea de a veni alături de mine și de a mă sprijini în acest moment în care vocea îmi dispare în totalitate. Domnul Chireac, DC News, primul care a aflat despre proiect și care, acum nu știu dacă e un denunț, mi-a zis să continui cu el. Vă mulțumesc! Vă mulțumesc, Vă mulțumesc tuturor!
Vă mulțumim foarte mult, domnule prim-ministru. Constat cu mare bucurie că relația noastră este mult mai bună de când ați părăsit fotoliul de la Palatul Victoria. Cu toată lumea este așa. Well, uh, I'll also address myself a little bit in English, not so long and not so good as the Prime Minister did it before. I guess uh, in Romania we have never had a think tank like uh, the Black Sea Regional Project 2020. And that's because uh, very few of us knows what actually is going on in a think tank. Uh, When uh, Mr. Victor Ponta was in the office in uh, the Victoria Palace, I always underlined that his foreign politics was again a top foreign politics. As a matter of fact, it was the first time we had a foreign politics since 2004. And this is uh, because... Sunt multe microfoane. Asta e pentru colegii români. It was the, for the first time since 2004 since Romania had again a foreign politics and that happened when uh, Prime Minister Ponta stepped in the office. Of course, after we solved those problems that uh, Mr. Ponta had uh, uh, underlined, uh, the NATO accession, the EU accession, uh, it was a problem how we are seeing our foreign politics. And I guess The ideas that uh, uh, Mr. Ponta had were very important. I followed his visit in Germany, in the United States, in uh, the Gulf, in the Persian Gulf. A lot, lots of opportunities. Um, for the moment, uh, Mr. Ponta uh, uh, resigned from the political position he had. And uh, I guess it's something very new for Romania to do a foundation, to do a think tank, and to stress probably to the most important thing that many ambassadors here present know about the economic diplomacy. Many of the countries, which are very good friends of Romania, have these initiatives. Unfortunately, our foreign minister doesn't have it too much. So a foundation led by tough personalities, the former prime ministers, and a very good team of ministers, probably the best we had since many years, can do all these kinds of things. That's why uh, myself and the team of uh, Dece News, we are honored and we consider it as a privilege to follow the works of this foundation, uh, to contribute as a journalist, as journalists, as thinkers, to whatever reasons and whatever important things are going to be developed through this foundation. So uh, I guess uh, Mr. Ponta is going to make history with, uh, let's put it like this, he has a chance a huge chance to make history with this foundation. All the political things are solved, in my opinion, because we all enjoy the presence of the actual president of the SDP party at the, at the foundation. So, Mr. Liviu Dragnea. So, thank you very much. Vă mulțumesc foarte mult. Am încercat și noi și vom face tot ce se poate să vă prezentăm în limba română și poate și în limba engleză lucrările Think Tank-ului. Vă rog, în final, niciodată n-a vorbit domnul Chiriac atât de frumos despre mine când eram în funcție, deci e un mare avantaj. Vreau să spun însă încă o dată că le mulțumesc colegilor mei care s-au alăturat de la început sau pe parcurs acestei idei și care conturează de fapt pentru obiectivele fundamentale ale acestui think tank un rezervor de cunoștințe și de expertiză pe care foarte, cel puțin în România, o altă organizație guvernamentală nu le poate oferi. Foști oameni care au condus la cel mai înalt nivel 
domeniul agriculturii, al sănătății, al justiției, al mediului de afaceri, al educației, al finanțelor, al muncii. Am rugat-o și îi mulțumesc pe Carmen Moldovan, președinta Organizației de, pentru Mediu din Camera Deputaților. Oameni care, repet, au avut ocazia nu doar să să aibă idei și proiecte, ci să și vadă ce înseamnă punerea lor în practică. Le mulțumesc, sper să, fim, să folosim această expertiză pentru binele României și al țărilor din regiune și cu această ocazie și cu ocazia încheierii vreau doar să anunț că sper că de astăzi începând și pagina de web și cu singurul cont oficial de Facebook că au apărut foarte multe în ultima perioadă, sunt funcționale, iar pot să vă anunț doar că ne propunem în această primăvară ca primele conferințe, primele dezbateri și primele rapoarte în ceea ce privește zona de energie, zona de agricultură, sănătate și exemplul de reformă fiscală al României, să putem să le lansăm practic în dezbatere. Mulțumesc tuturor, îmi cer scuze pentru lipsa de voce, am oarecare trag de a vorbi în public, dar pot să mă tratez în acest sens și mulțumesc tuturor celor care, repet, au fost alături de noi la acest moment de lansare. Începutul e întotdeauna dificil, dar the best is yet to come. Vă mulțumesc, thank you very much. Uf,